Floss Tube, Erin here at Fairy Tales and French Knots, and I just have a quick unpackaging video. I don't normally do these, but I'm really excited to share this. I haven't looked at it myself yet, so you can share the excitement with me. Um, this is from Deborah Harry's, and if you've uh, watched her on Facebook, she rescues old pieces of needlework and turns them into project bags. Now, I need a new project bag, like I need a hole in the head, but this was just too beautiful for me to pass up. So here is the package, the back of the package as it arrived at my house today. Uh, I'm not gonna show you the front because obviously it has my address on it, but here is the, uh, the, the package. So remove this. And first of all, you'll see there's this really sweet little card from Deb which says, thank you so much for your purchase. I hope you're pleased with the bag. So this is very sweet. Thank you for the card. And here is my bag wrapped in um, an old pattern, which is super cool. And I'll unwrap it with the bow. If you've followed her on Facebook, like I said, you may recognize what I got. Undo the tape. Oh, who cares? It's Christmas. Rip and shred, rip and shred. So, this is the bag. Oh, I'm kidding. This is the back of the bag, obviously. But the front is the lavender and lace Santa. And I saw this, I was, I was on Facebook while I was waiting for my daughter's swim team practice to end, and she had just posted this. I grabbed it like three minutes after she posted it. So I'm so excited. This is beautiful. The stitching is beautiful. The sewing is beautiful. The bag inside has lovely coordinating fabric. It's got a lovely little wrist strap. And there it is. There's my, my unwrapping video for you with my bag from Deborah Harry's. I will link it in the comments. I'll link her Facebook and I'll, if she has an Instagram, I'll, I'll link that too. But yeah, if you want to see some gorgeous rescued needlework, repurposed stitching bags, definitely check her out. So thanks. Bye.